second timothy 1 6 and 7 apostle paul just laid stead timothy and something happened second timothy 1 says wherefore i put thee in remembrance that thou stir up the gift of god which is in thee by the putting on of my hands the gift of god will enter you through the putting forth or putting on of the hands or somebody of higher concentration and listen to me wisdom is in levels same way foolishness is in levels when a man who has graduated into nonsense degree in foolishness lays hands on you or words on you all of a sudden your wisdom park is eroded and you enter into the way of foolishness into your grave but tonight may god order your steps that amen he needs a recharge Let me see that scripture. <laughs> Verse number seven. Call that by the way. It says, stare, stare. Wherefore, stare. For God has not given us the spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of a sound mind. In other words, anything that has been stored in you must be stared. Stare up the gift of God that is in you. By the putting on of my hands, stay. Whatever God has stored in you must be stirred. How does it get stirred? By the putting forth of the. Are you here at all? It's not every program that is advertised that you must attend. Some of them is the production house of foolishness. Many of us have similar content of the gift of God in us, the blessing of God, but not similar stirring. So the laying on of hands will stir the gift of God that is in you. It's called impartation. Say impartation. When hands are laid on you, the giftings of God in you, they will be stirred. Different stirring will bring different results. So you can be heavily loaded and until impartation comes to stir, you are still where you are in a state of inertia. I'm telling you, having to see people, they are just motivated and they do great things. That's naturally. You motivate people, they will achieve the higher heights for you. Spiritually, we don't motivate people. We impact and the impartation stirs them. Rabiba Lagada, Sudabreke Ketoko, Ijegre Gedek. Are you here at all? When men of higher concentration lay hands on you, whatever gift God has put in you for business, for marriage, for ministry, they will be stirred up. And if you are believing God for a stirring, shout a louder, Amen.